Ariel Helwani post-fight at UFC 158 alongside Patrick Cote, who just defeated Bobby Volker tonight. And Patrick, uh, it seemed like the crowd, the media split on who won the fight. Do you think you deserve to win it? Uh, you know, I gave everything. That's that's what I know. Uh, I think I won the first round for sure. He won the, the third one, and the second round was was pretty tight. But uh, you know, even if I was on my back, I was attacking all the time. I, no, I think I showed that I work a lot on my back, my jiu jitsu. I try, you know, a couple of armbar, triangle, uh, even the moplata. Uh, you know, I was working a lot on my back, but um, and you take can't you can't take a punt. I, I hit him pretty hard, and he was still going forward. But you know what, I gave everything, I'm very happy about the win. How close were you to being finished in the third round? How dicey was that for you? Uh, I wasn't close to be finished. I was tired, you know, I'll, I'll be honest, but uh, I wasn't close to be, to, you know, I've never tapped bef uh, on their strike, and never in my life, and I will never do that. Uh, you know, I got submit in the, in the past, but, you know, I can take punishment. Uh, everybody who was, uh, you know, worried about my, my chin, maybe because of the last fight, I think they, they, they saw that my chin is still good tonight. Were you tired because of the weight cut? Uh, maybe. Uh, I'm, I don't know. I'm going to have to talk to my nutritionist, talk to my team. Uh, I want to see the fight uh, on video, too. I think the first two rounds, the pace was really high. Uh, it was really fast. So, but for sure, you know, it's probably, you know, the weight cut got me in the third round, but I don't want to be, I don't want to do, uh, to make any excuse. Bobby was giving me a hard pace. He was going forward. He hit me pretty hard. And uh, man, he was, he was going forward all the, all the time. How was the weight cut? And do you still feel like this is the right weight class for you? Oh yeah, for sure. You know, I felt pretty good on the scale. The weight cut was really easy. Seriously, that was the easiest cut in my, in my career. Uh, but you know, like I said, it's, uh, it's the experience now. Uh, I still learn about this process. All the no I don't have all the knowledge. Uh, I'm, I'm working with pro nutritionists until uh, since December on, uh, only. So I still have to learn about this process, but I'm staying with the weight. How's your face feeling? Feel good, feel good. You know, uh, the damage I have in my, my face, it's the result of only two knees. Uh, you know, the ground and pound didn't hit me very hard. It's, you know, he gave me one knee when we were in the clinch against the, against the defense, and he, he timed me pretty well uh, in the clinch in the, in, the, in the middle of the octagon when I tried to shoot. Uh, but uh, you know what, uh, the ground and pound didn't, didn't hurt me at all. But the two knees was uh, pretty nice. Finally, are you gonna go do the TV work now? Uh, yeah, yeah. You know the the dog did, the dog did, gave me a good stitcher. He did a pretty good job. So I'll go. You know, hey, that's good. No rest for you. That's unbelievable. Enjoy that. Good luck with that, and congratulations on the win. Thank you very much, Aya.